that, you know, how has the documentary maybe suffered, I suppose, in current affairs in terms of television in the UK? Well, I think it has suffered. I mean, and it, it, it suffered first in America, so I was sort of ready for it, you know, because, you know, news became entertainment, you know, very much so in America. The actual news bulletins were entertaining, supposedly. Fox News became an entertainment, you know, it didn't become news, it was entertainment and taking positions and creating arguments and all this. But, you know, in the, in the, in the kind of the business, the, the economies of broadcasting and all this, you know, documentaries don't necessarily get you big audiences and sometimes you have to tart documentaries up to attract a big audience. So, you know, it's, I think it's getting harder and harder to do them, but they've survived much more in British television because I think there's quite a deep-rooted history of documentaries in Great Britain. And I don't think Great Britain has suffered as much as American entertainment has in, you know, in kind of isolating or marginalizing documentaries. I think you get much better documentaries on television in the UK than you do in America. That's true.